I'm gonna I'm gonna hit record and I'm gonna talk about this. All right, uh, let's just dive right back in. So, I didn't sleep much last night, like at all, which is a bit of a shame. But I spent much of last night try trying to go to bed and dreaming up plans for how to design an automated farm, new vehicles, traps, and some other things. Like, it's it's bad. <laughs> I was not expecting that I would uh, I would be that obs obsessed about this game. Also, thank you, Tyron CZ, for the five gifted subs. I This might happen today. I don't know. Whatever. It's okay. Uh, <laughs> do not... Do not go to uh, Subware on my behalf. It's okay. It's okay. All right, where the hell am I and why am I here? Oh, right! I remember why I'm here. I went here for screenshots because I wanted to actually prep the YouTube series so I have more than just, like... I. One thing I used to do with the old Scrap Mechanic series is uh, a new thumbnail for every video, and I'm going to stick to that. I might still keep my sidebar, but it'll be a, a different screenshot and, like, a different thing happening because there's a lot of stuff going on. Anyway, uh, so we're going to go back, and I'm going to spend the next hour or two trying to design a farm that doesn't suck that I can actually store massive amounts of crops and not constantly starve to death. And also, if we're lucky, defenses so that it can kind of defend itself with less effort on my part. Also, thank you, Endergrim, for the 16-month resub. 16 months for the return of the game that shouldn't be named. At this point, everybody on Twitch can talk about it. Everybody on YouTube, uh, not fresh out of luck, but it's going to take a little while longer because I have to... Why the hell is that there? I don't know. I, uh, what? Oh, okay. That was weird. Alright. I'm just gonna retrieve whatever wood that is. There we go. Uh, let's see. But yeah, I have to, uh, I have to remove it from the blacklist on YouTube. And I haven't quite gotten around to that because I'm lazy bones, which is a bit of a shame. Let's see, can you make a Wongol death trap? I was thinking about a Wongol death trap. I don't think it would work particularly well. I'm pretty sure the robots would just wreck him. Uh, what I would like to do is get a, a Wongol mining drill set up, if possible. I have no idea if it's possible. The main problem is I'm going to need to cut down a bunch of trees and process that into lumber. And that could be a bit of a challenge. We'll see how it goes. Uh, so you're good at these things if you need any help. I, I'm going to be doing solo for a while. I've reached out to a couple of people. No idea if I'm going to get any bites for multiplayer. I still need to reach out to like one or two other people. Because uh, I would like to do some multiplayer for this. Solo is just going to be kind of... I think solo is going to be the main thing just because that's how I work nowadays. And it's easier. We need water. We need buckets. Out of fuel. Holy crap, you are a guzzler. That's a bit of a problem. I wonder if I can uh, get like a solar charger or some kind of green renewable energy. I'm not going to be super thrilled if I have to constantly gather oil, but I have some solutions that might work. So we'll see how it goes. Did that bot not discover that I just drove past? All right, cool. Let's pick this up. Gosh, the amount of comments on YouTube. I don't know if any of you guys watched my first episode. Probably uh, not those of you watching live, but the amount of people that were mad because I forgot how to pick things up in this game is kind of upsetting. <laughs> like, I forgot how to pick up the master battery, and so the entire first episode's comment section is like 50% like, yay, scrap mechanic, and the other 50% is like, you idiot, how do you not know how to pick things up anymore? And it's just like, eh. Oh, okay. Right, I got the bucket, but I didn't actually get water. Uh, let's see, no wonder cam today. I thought about it, and honestly, I'm not sure what I'm going to do for wonder cam. Um, oh, oh. Missed one. I'll just peel this one. Uh, I like face cam. But, uh, it's hard. It's actually kind of... Oh, he's just stuck. Looks like he's after my crops, but I'm not entirely sure. Alright. 
So we actually have to refill these things. So what I think I am going to do, though, is I want to see if I can get an auto pump system. Gathering water like this sucks. Let's see, no face cam doesn't fit this kind of game. I think face cam actually would fit fine for scrap mechanic. Uh, there's a number of funny things that do happen. And so my reactions could be worthwhile. At the same time, I have to... I have to be really lazy. Well, no. I don't have to be really lazy. I am really lazy. And that's why I don't want to. Ah, I missed. Okay. Uh, let's see. Wonder you've upgraded your car. How did you do it? Uh, this bad boy over here. You don't upgrade it with the, uh, the crash ship. You upgrade it using the parts made from CraftBot. Okay. Uh, let's see. So I, I should probably also repeat the usual... Uh, the usual thing of, well, hmm, yeah, I guess, mm, no, I'm going to starve here, that's normal, we want to use all of these carrots to make some more soil, I've got three soil bags, let's go over here, I guess I'll grab the potatoes, we're not really using them for much. But yeah, I'm quite aware that I'm not going to... I, I don't know what I'm doing, and I'm not doing things fast enough. But it's also one of those that, like, I really do like learning on my own. And so people yelling at me uh, for what to do is actually going to get frustrating. Okay. Oh, ship has a microwave that you might be able to use to cook food. It's all the way over there, though. Also, didn't think I could interact with it, but still. Okay. Let's see, how'd you get craft bot? You gotta go to the garage. So I'm gonna... I'm gonna let these carrots grow. We're gonna use them to make soil. Uh, this is just going to be a starter garden that the robots aren't gonna attack. Where do I... Mm, I wanna find a peninsula. This kind of works. It's not the best peninsula. A, s a full island would probably work better. But I'm lazy and I don't want to get too far away. Let's see, is this game still a laggy mess? I haven't run into a whole lot of lag. Uh, it slows down a little bit when it's loading... Uh, it slows down a little bit when it's loading new chunks. Uh, so if you're driving too far too fast, it does slow down a bit. But compared to starter scrap mechanic, not nearly as uh, not nearly as laggy as it used to be. I gotta get a saw blade at some point. I wonder if like oh, we gotta get a controller and probably a second engine because it would be really cool to actually have like a uh, ar extendo arms that I can like bring down and control, maybe. I need a lot of... I need a... Gosh. I need a bigger car if I want to do that, though. So we might want to actually eventually spring for two vehicles. A very big one, and... A much smaller one. Big one would handle... Resource collection and not go too far away from... Base. Maybe I just have a crane on the back, because that could make sense. Yeah, because if I could, if I could have a heavy a heavy car that could put down like um like the wheels could lift and it would just stick stakes down instead with higher friction maybe and a crane on the back. I could potentially control the crane using you know a controller setup with a with a chair on the back. And use that to drill things by dropping the drill on top of the rocks. That should that should solve at least some problems. I don't know. I've got a lot of ideas on things that I want to make. And I can't wait to get started. It's going to take a little while before we really get there. We're also going to starve before that happens, but it is what it is. Let's see, how long have I been streaming? Ten minutes? About ten minutes. Unfortunately, you guys are going to hear me starve to death. Here, uh, can we get a can we get a scrap starve counter? Uh, if anybody uh, feels terribly motivated for that sort of thing, because 
I'm actually curious how many times... Because yesterday I was just letting it happen. I just didn't care. Because I knew there was going to be no no easy way for me to feed, my, feed myself and actually be... Uh, there's no easy way for me to feed myself and create interesting content out of the first six hours. And so I just gave up on feeding myself entirely. And... Today, I'm gonna try and handle the basics. I think you starved like four times before. Four or five would make sense. But I, I'd love to see a tally of just... Uh, how bad I am at actually surviving. Because I'm doing decent with uh, with progress, but survival, you know, I don't know. One feature, by the way, that I'm, I'm going to absolutely gush about several times is if I stop working, I can resume refining at the same state that I was at previously. It probably goes back down uh, eventually, but, like, it really does help. All right, so let's, uh, let's grab some carrot seeds while we're here. Six should be enough. Especially because can't do anything else. All right, these are going. May need to consider getting this game myself. Scrap mechanic is... Uh, like... Obviously, I'm a bit biased, but Scrap Mechanic is honestly one of the best games I've ever played. It doesn't have quite the level of, like, sheer polish that it's... Let's go with Hollow Knight. Like, I, I will admit Hollow Knight is probably just a better game. But that's because of... It perfectly sets out what it accomplishes. Uh, it, it's set out to do a very specific thing and perfectly accomplishes that with, like, no problems. Do I want to do this? This location kind of blows. Or do we want to just have the central garage? Do I want to have the central garage farm? Or do I want to have a pen peninsula farm? Because the one problem with the peninsula farm is I actually have to come out here and handle it. Let's not. Let's be lazy. But... What I I do think I will move it around. I'm gonna scout this area for a moment anyway, just to see what we've got. I gotta remember to get a headlight and slap it on this thing. Cause yeah, a small island would solve all problems, but I don't see any. There's there's one small island at the very beginning of the game, but that's so far away from everything else that until I have a flying vehicle, I don't know if that's actually worth my time. Hello. That said, if we're talking peninsulas, this is pretty primo. Somebody was sassing me in the comments thinking of it. The, uh, the lifts were temporary. Okay. I might have to revise. This is... I'm gonna say... Uh, I'd almost say it's peak farmland, except for these goddamn bushes. Yeah, you know what? No, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna play for the risk. Let's... Let's be boring, make our base at the garage. Two reasons. One, I can actually see my crops. Uh, currently, there's no way to like clear grass or bushes, and that blows. Let's see, what's this on the ground? Oh, more scrap metal. I'll grab it. Okay. But yeah, I'll, I'll just be boring, build my base at the garage, just like everybody else. Mainly because the garage is so easy to find. And while it's not, like, a perfect system, it's still easier to kind of centralize all of my resource structures until I get more better stuff. So the question is, where do I want to build it? Okay, first question. Oh, hell yeah. Okay. I think what we're going to want to do is put it right here. Like, move the garden over to this spot. It's well lit, which doesn't really help with the crops growing, but... Uh, let's see. 
It won't help with the crops growing, but those two uh, parallel embankments, curbs, effectively, should block all robots from uh, from reaching me. I'll have to test it. We should probably go aggro robot and bring it back. Okay. Uh, there's one guy over here. Let's let's see if we can do it. Sup, nerd? Okay. He's following me. This is good. Okay. So first thing, first things first, can he get up here? No, no, no. Come back. Come back. Perfect. All right. So I'm not going to count these as impenetrable, but I can count them impenetrable enough. Let's see. Music is a tad loud. I can turn it down. Sorry about that. There we go. That should be better. Okay. So can't guarantee this with every type of crop. Uh, or not every type of crop, but every setup. This should work. Uh, where did all my stone go? Must have put it in a chest. Alright, let's grab those. I'm just going to make a basic double stone wall. And then we're going to slowly start putting the uh, gardens up in here. Hell, I'm not even sure if I'm going to need much more than this. These guys get... Let's see. I think some of that went underground. And yes, I'm quite aware they can break blocks. Okay, so that doesn't work. Maybe EDM. Let's try EDM. We'll see how it goes. But yes, I'm aware they can break blocks. But there's pretty much nowhere that I can put my crops without dealing with that. The one exception that I can think of would be... Um... Let's see. There it is. The one exception I could think of would be a remote, like a proper remote island, which would be hard. Uh, let's see, put it here. Yeah, that seems reasonable enough. How many blocks is that? It's like four out. I want to play it by ear, but I also really want to like measure this whole thing. Okay. We're going to need a lot more soil than that. That's still... Do different blocks have different health? Oh, yeah. These grown yet? No. Well, quick question. Can I actually just plant these? Because we know for a fact they don't get mad if I have three. If I tried right-clicking dirt plots? Yeah, I have. It doesn't come back up. Maybe there, maybe there's some way of doing it, but I, I have not seen it. <sighs> Missed. All right, it's fine. So we need, we need to go find Big Boy. I'll move Big Boy closer. I think. Uh, let's see. So I'm gonna. I'm going to put Big Boy right here. Ah, that's perfect. All right, Big Boy. We need to make... we got to figure some things out. So there's a vacuum pump, which requires... Oh, that's actually not so bad. Glass blocks shouldn't even be bad either. Uh, okay, so we need a lot of embers. But we know where to get a lot of embers now, so that's good. Yeah, because I don't want to manually 
deal with any of this stuff. Okay, so let's let's grab the requisite materials. Let's start with the vacuum pump, and then I'm gonna try and work from there. Grab these. A hey, yeah, I actually had a little bit more of that than I thought. I, I think the rest of this I can just leave here for the time being. Uh, let's see. Okay, so we want to make vacuum pump. Craft that, and then we're gonna need. More metal block twos, that's fine. And we're gonna need a decent amount of glass blocks. At least I can make a lot of sand blocks too. Uh, gosh, I would love to upgrade CraftBot again, just for all of those slots. Well, leave it for later. Okay. Unfortunately, it's a bit of a long wait to get the rest of these down. Honestly, maybe I should make another big boy at some point. Okay. Let's see. The boss bot can get over. I think I'll be fine. If the boss bot gets in, I have more things to worry about than my crops. Probably. I could be wrong. What I would like to do, though, is, uh... I'm not gonna say try and proof it, but I want to have a bunch of water cannons up in this area. Effectively, what I'd like to do is utilize... Uh, hmm... I wonder if I can use the vacuum pump to suck both water and one of those oil things. Okay. Let's grab a couple of those. This is going to take some time. Well. Ooh. Wait. Are vacuum pipes singular or do I get multiple? Gosh, I hope I get multiple. If it's only singleton, we might want to move. Or mass fab somehow. Well, time to find out if I get only one of these or if I get... I only get one. How big is it? Oh, that's interesting. You can actually, like, change its placement. Alright, so it's a bit bigger than I thought it would be. But it's also very expensive. That sucks. so many resources to actually move things around. Uh, is it for liquid or items? Both. Yeah, so we have item transit tubes, which is exciting, and everything I was hoping for. The biggest issue is they're very expensive compared to what I currently have. Like, I, I'm going to bankrupt myself trying to build this thing. I mean, okay. I guess one option is... I have one of these, right? I've got one vacuum pump. Let's go back here. I'm gonna do... Can I make at least a corner? Kind of. I think what I'm going to do is just purely have, yeah, water storage tanks on car for delivery. I was thinking something like that. I'm going to need more glue, though. Gosh, I'm going to need a lot of glue.
But what I was really hoping is I could actually convert the water some how else. Oh. Okay, that's that's actually useful. Is there some corn over here? There was. Yes. That should be good. All right, let's go find me a cow. Yeah, so one way or another, getting enough vacuum tubes to actually pipe water over to this base sucks. I don't... I might be fine with that, but I just... It doesn't seem like it's worth it. There it goes. That was confusing. It's like it didn't want the corn. Please eat more. All right, so we've gotten milk. Maybe I won't starve today. I won't starve today. All right. Honestly, that's almost better food than I was possibly imagining. So we got to start hoarding corn. Uh, let's see, make a pen for it. I like my cows free range, at least for now. Eventually, once I have better stuff, then I will... Then I will bother, but right now I would feel guilt. <sighs> okay, fertilizer. That's only gonna be one soil bag, ain't it? Mm, that sucks. Alright, so let's let's go back to this. So if I want to make a water storage tank, right, I need glue. So I'm gonna have to go swimming. And the other question is, how many crops can I fit into an area before it yells at me for unauthorized farming? Because I think the number is usually three. Uh, yeah, I guess, I guess I'm going to just go swimming for glue and we'll go from there. I'd say I do have a bunch of corn on the one farm wall. Yeah, but there's just tons of corn all over the place if I start gathering it. I'd mostly just been ignoring it because I didn't have a functional use for it at the time. Now I do. Now I can hydrate myself at the very least. I Feeding myself is still going to be a little harder. The milk isn't quite as efficient in that regard, but eventually we'll get Cookbot and hopefully he'll handle that part. Okay, so I need some clams. What I'd like to do eventually is actually have vacuum pumps. God damn it. Uh, can I just eat this? Probably shouldn't. I need more soil. But I also need food. Uh, damn. Why do I have a battery in my inventory? Uh, I'm a goof. Alright. This should be enough for now. Holy shit, that is a durable clam. I No amount of pounding is going to get that clam open. So let's just ignore that one. I wonder if you can actually upgrade my... Uh, let's see. Upgrade my sledgehammer. I guess... What would that do? Not a whole lot. So there, there's actually a bit of a clam fiesta around here, which is nice. It means I don't have to go too far. I don't think I'm ever going to be able to actively farm the clams, but I don't need them nearly as much. 
But what I'd like to do is get some vacuum pumps set up on top of one of those oil vents and see if I can actually uh, process fuel, uh, like automatically create fuel. And we gotta, we gotta go check out that big base sooner than later. I just want to get maybe the rudimentary setup for food. Oh, you can upgrade it. it. Lets you block in combat. Aha! That would ex explain why that one person was critically confused. Speaking of, I heard that you can run into... I heard. I saw that you can run into the, the big boss bot somewhere around here. Or at least somewhere in the water. <laughs> around here is maybe a bit false. Okay, I'm just going to pick these up. Because it looks like we are we are peaked out on clams. Okay. Well, <sighs> there we go. Let's get back. Yeah, I'm not starving as much. This is this is a good thing. Let's see, your push-up's okay today. I'm gonna leave it off. I only got like four or five hours of sleep today, and I am tired. Unless I turn them on, at which point I don't know. I would, I would like to keep with the push-ups, but I don't want to strain myself, so I kind of rather rather not. They are on. I should go turn them off then. But well, let's let's stuff this cow silly first, assuming it'll actually. Obey the law of corn. Feed me, beast. Okay. At least we finally found an immediate use for corn. Still a little grumpy you can't eat the corn, but I guess it makes sense. But it it's almost to the point where I don't actually need to uh, farm anymore. We just need to constantly hoard mass amounts of... Uh, We just need to hoard mass amounts of corn and then find one cow to just, like, stuff silly. Okay. That should be enough milk. That's a lot of milk, in fact. And yes, I'm aware you can cook the corn in a cook bot. It's just not super feasible for me right now. Uh, let's see. Right. I'm gonna clear my inventory out. I picked up a bunch of things so I could actually do work, but whoops. All right, whatever. Uh, let's see, put away the battery. Put away the chemicals. We need some of that stuff. We don't We don't need the beeswax, I don't think. I don't think we need as much ember. Okay, let that go. Right. I do need the beeswax, in fact. Uh, gosh. I'm gonna need so much glue. So yeah, maybe... Maybe some form of, uh... Vacuum pump system will be in order. Water, oil, clams. I'm not actually sure if I can. Let's see. Do you have a proper setup yet, or do you accept deaths now and then? Well, I was planning on dying a couple more times today. Uh, but what ended up happening is I uh, finally figured out how to feed the cows and get milk off of them. And that had a fairly uh, major effect on my ability to not starve to death constantly. Okay, so let's let's make a uh, make a water container. Yep. Bash made a starve uh, counter. 
right before I possibly stop starving entirely. <laughs> now, nah, I will probably still starve. Let's see, is there a way to get him so he moves completed items to a chest? Yes. It actually looks like all of these guys have the capacity for it. Main problem is I need vacuum tubes in large quantities. Uh, grab one more of these and one more of these. The problem with that is I'm going to need a lot of iron. It's not so bad. Okay. So yeah, it, it actually looks like I can, uh... Oh. I can hook this guy up to two chests. Or, I could potentially hook him up to the same chest. That'd be funny. Alright, let's go back to processing those. We're gonna need a lot more iron. Uh, what I'm probably gonna have to do is go bananas on a, um... A couple more mining spots. <sighs> okay. So let's just run over here. I'm going to make a, uh... I'm just going to make a rudimentary water pump out here. If we're lucky, I'll just be able to carry it to and from. Uh, probably by hand. 